Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Uh, today is the second day of PAX East 2016 and um, I just wanted to tell you guys how my first day went. It was epic. It was crazy. Um, your boy didn't go to sleep till probably about like 2, maybe 3 a.m. And uh, I'm up now giving you guys an update because there's a lot I need to talk to you guys about. So first thing is uh the first day of pax um i'm a media uh entity at pax east i don't know where my badge is at right now it's probably in the bathroom but uh i started my day off at 9 a.m sharp um i ended up at pax east and i played a few games i played the new gears i played the new uncharted i played uh the new battleborn and i played um what else was that? what was that mirror's edge i played the new mirror's edge so um, the gist of Uncharted to me really was that the game is just like any other Uncharted. Um, the multiplayer, what we ended up playing was we ended up playing a, a, a mode where you had to pick up a relic and you had to take it back to your base and you had to protect the runner basically. Um, and with Uncharted, uh, I had to learn the game mechanics very quickly because, you know, they just told me to dive right in. And uh, it was pretty fun. So, you know, um, I will say that Uncharted is probably going to be one of those games that I get. I was already going to get it for the story mode. Everyone already knows this. I play these games, Chase. But um, Gears, Gears was one of those games where you just got done playing Uncharted. You think you know everything about third person. But I had this Xbox controller in my hand. And I'm like what am i supposed to do here but uh i got the the eric got basically uh i would say maybe 70 to 80 percent of the control mechanics down and we actually won our first match but we lost terribly in our second match and that was due to two of our members leaving so uh what happened was the enemy would walk around the map see a person just standing there because we were playing on a dam and we were playing on um, a mood where like you had to kill all enemies in order to win and it was something like a team deathmatch, but you could kind of save people a little bit, you know what I'm saying? So, like, it was, it felt like a little bit like the division in that aspect. But, um, I saved maybe one or two people, but it was a wrap after that. Um, I think it was like a four man team on each side because that's how they set up the land party. But, um, Gears felt pretty good. Um, I'm not sure that Gears is one of those games that's going to drive me to getting an Xbox One. But, um, if anybody out there wants to buy me one, by all means, if you want to play Gears with me, just, you know, hit up my PayPal. But uh, I'm just playing. But uh, Mirror's Edge, oh my God, that first person makes you want to just throw up. Like, it's you're all over the place, man. Mirror's Edge is probably one of those games where it needs to be VR. Like, I'm talking, like, right now, like, straight up VR. No, don't even make it on a regular console anymore without VR because that game seems epic, man. Just imagine... Um, you got the, the hand grips or whatever or controllers that you need from VR and you're like running and like you got something attached to your legs, see your legs, like yo, that it would just be so fire, man. Mirror's Edge is definitely a game that um looks good, feels good, but boy, um everybody remembers like one time I think I was playing GTA five and like I had to control the plane and your boy was getting seasick like motion sickness from playing a freaking video game so i know that mirror's edge is one of those games that had me a little woozy especially i didn't put nothing on my stomach in the morning so you know i was just out there like whoa <laughs> but um the next game that i played uh i played battleborn last um mainly because um the 2k booth was popping even at like 9 a.m um for the media content people so i came over played a little bit of battleborn i was like you know what i think i should have played the beta with utx in them because the game was pretty good i liked it um it felt pretty good um you can kind of immerse yourself in it um it was really nice but uh what they really had us doing was battling up against four other people because every game that you play at pax really is like a 4v4 because of the way they set their monitors up you have four on one side of the table four on the other side um they have headsets and mics that you can talk to every player they have the controller layout right here so like when you're looking down you can kind of get a feel for what the controls is and you know it was a good setup for each booth uh i will say that out of all the games that i played today um it's one that i need to mention to you guys now um i checked out the htc vibe and oh my god vr is serious bro like it's i'm so honest with you guys right now like it's it's crazy like it's crazy like no like it's it's crazy 
You like you not understand? It's crazy. <laughs> so after I got done playing a bunch of video games, um, we met up with Cash Nasty and the crew. Uh, Took was out there. Shake and Bake was out there. Uh, Lost and Unbound was out there. Los was out there. Like Black Frank White was out there. It was a lot of different people out there, man. Um, a lot of new YouTubers that I actually met for the first time. You know, uh, we all follow each other on Twitter as well. Uh, as well as we got this little DM popping where you know this gets crazy in the DMs. But um, we went out to this place called Boston Basketball and we played a bunch of five v five, man. Um, your boy played two games, got two Ws. You know, um, the footage most likely is going to be out on Cash Nasty's channel, uh, Lowe's channel, Lost and Unbound channel, and Shake and Bake's channel. Um, I think they all got different perspectives, different views. Nobody told me to bring my cameraman. Let's just put it like that. Your boy didn't bring no cameraman out there, but your boy brought the skills. The skills. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't never get crossed. You know what I'm saying? I might have shot an air ball or two. But your boy got the buckets, you know what I'm saying? It got the W's. So, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you guys going to see that footage on their channel. I almost like to drop a promo, promo on my channel um, just to let you guys know that they are up on their channels, you know what I'm saying, whenever they drop theirs. Um, after we hit the basketball court, came back to the room, caught a shower, and um, that's when I went back to PAX to play that HCC Vive. I'm going to say it again. That HCC Vive, though? Bro, like, I had two controllers in my hand, right? I had the, had the headset on. And I was playing this little shooting game where, like, I had to shoot spaceships. Like, and it felt like a real arcaded game. But I can do a 360 turn and see so much, right? Like, so much is behind me. And, like, it was a battle of waves. And, like, at first they only gave me one gun because the other controller had died. And it was like, yo, how did you get the wave 8 already with just one gun? And by the time they gave me two guns, two of them things, two of them, 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 them pretty Ninas, I was going in, man. Um, I set the high score. I was um, ranked third on the leaderboard because, like, when the like when the game is over, you can look to your left and look at the leaderboard. And I was third and seventh. Like, I was seventh with one gun, and I jumped from seventh to third when I got the two guns. I only did it with two guns twice because other people were coming, and I was already there for, like, a half an hour. I would not get off the game. Like, it's so serious. But, um, after that, um, I kicked it up at the Elgato, uh, streaming booth where the streaming pods were. Checked out the HD Pro, the, uh, AC60S. And after that, we headed over to the Twitch, uh, mixer partner mixer uh and um we played a lot of bowling man um the proof is in a pudding on twitter your boy just i don't know man i don't know what it is with these two fingers and this thumb but like it just ain't i, I don't know man I, I i ain't got it no more so your boy needs to start going bowling again and plus it was most likely because they didn't have many balls that i like pause but uh, this is your boy IKC signing out. Um, day two is Among Us. I will give you guys all the information on everything that I go see, check out, play tomorrow um, for a day two wrap up. Um, this is your boy IKC signing out. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share with your friends. Peace.